hey guys greetings i hope you are doing well good to see you um i want to show you tell you about cscs account um it's about how to checkmate your portfolio how to checkmate your share portfolio your investment portfolio especially if you are buying shares from nigeria stock exchange okay i want to show you how you can monitor your stock brokers you know if you buy a share obviously you they open up account for you for you to buy and sell shares in nigeria stock exchange as an investor but you know there's a lot of things that is happening in the market but also a lot of uh, stock brokers some of them are quite um, depletious. Some of them are quite, um, you know, corny and funny. So that's what I'm saying. You need to do your own research, but also put in place a lot of security mechanisms to be able to um, checkmate your stockbroker firm. Okay. So what I want to show you is something called cscs okay cscs i want to show you um cscs nigeria is um so type in cscs dot ng is something that every investor needs to have okay you need to register with cscs to be able to checkmate monitor your shares okay the cscs i told you this is the company cscs i will should tell you what cscs does every investor in nigeria stock exchange must have cscs number you need to ask your stock broker to give you your cscs number cscs number because the function and the main job of cscs is they are depository cscs serve this is what their job is they serve as a central security depository for all the security transact transacted in Nigerian Stock Exchange. So CSES function as the central security depository for all security transacted in Nigerian capital market. As such, CSES PLC keep and maintain an electronics book entry record of all security, including shares bond treasury bill etc to facilitate the safekeeping and easy transfer of security between parties during a trade so as an investor anytime you buy a share after three days it will they will forward your share certificate electronically to cscs as an individual investor you need to you know in those days you know i remember years ago during my dad time they used to buy a share and put it in our lunch you know share certificates and put it in our on the wall or in the photo frame in our lunch some of these share certificates some of them are fake some of them are original in those days but now everything is electronically so everything is electronics so for you to checkmate your stock broker you need to have account with cscs you need to as an investor in nigerian stock exchange to checkmate your stock broker because cscs is the different organization It's more or less like there are the the watchdog here because it, any of your shares supposed to correspond with your stockbroker account 
your portfolio account with your stockbroker supposed to correspond with amount of shares you have with CSCS. So you need to register with CSCS and they will give you a login details. Okay, now how to first of all to register you need to pay i want to refer to you what they are saying shareholders shareholders who have have who still have physical share certificate are therefore advised to visit their stock brokers to initiate the process of dematerializing their share certificate so because things are moving on things are changing everything now is electronics i live in uk and I buy shares in Nigeria, okay, in millions. And these shares certificate are in my email address, but also is deposited with CSCS after three working days. The sentence is applicable if I sell any of my shares, and if I sell any of my unit on particular company for instance after three days it will go off it will it will show you on my portfolio as a minus okay but also within three days it will show you if you do the transaction it will show you transaction that is done about to be taken off from your portfolio so this is you know something that every investor in nigerian stock exchange need to have you have a csc account but you must have you know register with them okay you need to register but i'm afraid it's not free of charge but is this is how you will be able to monitor your shares outside your stock brokerage firm monitor it from outside from different angle this is what is it's pretty much like a another organization because your stockbroker will buy share for you after three working days this would be deposited within the with CSCS office but also register registrar also have their list you can phone your register to check so you have several options where to check your shares to make sure it rhymes or is the same amount with a, a tallies up with what your stockbroker is telling you okay this day and age you need to be alert you need to be intelligent you need to be wise you need to you know know what you are doing so registering with CSCS but it's I'm afraid it's not free you, you need to register and I want to sh tell you what you need to do registration is online okay what you need to do is it shows says here registration for online access require a subscription fee i remember i paid five years fee for this five years as an individual investor if you are a company okay let's see what is saying registration for online access require subscription fee which varies depending on your account type okay 2688 naira for individual investor that is for a year 5375 for corporate investor and people who are special account or corporate slash special account family uh, okay and a special account family then 53,750 for stock brokers and custodians. Subscription fee may be paid online using your Naira debit card, debit card or through online transfer, which is internet banking. I think this is the one I did. Or cash deposit into any of the following accounts. So once you the account to transfer this is GTB account, GT Grantee Trust Bank account, 
which is 00029258874 or uba account which is 10068642140 then the next thing to do is account name is CSCSPLC. If you are paying through online transfer, kindly add your C clearing house number as a remark and contact us after payment on contact at CSCS.ng or if telephone number 0700 2255272. If you make cash deposit, kindly use deposit slip number to register account online. GTB Bank may require you to supply your desired username, email address, mobile number, CSCS or member code. This is something that I suggest for you to have to checkmate your portfolio your shares certificate to make sure your account tallies so once you've done the payment then what you need to do is come to this end at the bottom here for help for help instruction mouse over the green question mark beside okay so what we need to do right now is to fill this okay to registration you need to Individual select individual investor. The next thing to do your CS CS number clearing house number. We need to speak to your stock broker. Every investor in Nigeria stock exchange has CHN number clearing house number. Then you type your surname. Okay. The next thing is order name, your email address. Confirm your email address, alternative email address, okay? Then telephone number, alternative telephone number, desired user, okay? And password. Once you select that, teller number. But that is if you if you made a payment by the bank, but if you paid online, you just select online and select continue. Once you've done that, they will catch up all your capture all your information, and with that, they will open account to you and send you this information via your email address that you put in. This is how to go about this. This is how to go about it. Okay, so I want to show you, but you know, my own account. I'm gonna be mindful of the security here, but I want to show you for you to know that what I'm talking about in the need for you to have a CSCS account. Okay, I'm gonna show you how to do this so that it'll be easy for you to look something for you to you need to have. So what you need to do is go to C go to C C S C S go to C S C S Nigeria now you so you select okay this is my own account okay uh, i'm quite mindful of my details which you know i don't really want you to see i'm afraid but i just want to show you um I just want to sh show you
now this is this is the details okay this is my cs cs account okay so it's just a way for you to checkmate your stockbroker okay then i'm gonna sign out but it is something that every investor need to have you need to have cs cs account for you to be able to checkmate your stock brokers okay so this is central security clearing system plc every investor in nigerian stock exchange must have this must register with cscs number for you to be able to checkmate your stock brokers for you to be able to know exactly how much shares you have make sure that nothing because sometimes these people can sell your share without your consent without you even knowing so this one that is this is the reason why you need to register with cscs i encourage you to have this because this is only way for you to be able to checkmate and make sure that your portfolio remain the same okay it's pretty much like a, it's a clearing house is this is where all the shares are deposited okay so all the shares you know traded or people bought in nigerian stock exchange are deposited within with cscs okay so i just thought to share with you something that you need to have as an investor central security clearing system every investor i encourage you guys to register with these people for you to be able to monitor your shares outside your stock broker because it's good for you to have another alternative another platform where you can check and make sure that everything tallies up thank you very much guys for listening i just thought to share with you what every investor you will need to have it will it will, it will, it will show you it say you can see um monitor your stock online this is what it's telling you monitor monitor your stock online welcome to cscs okay the central security clearing house document conversion cs digital center paper conversion they convert all your paper all the paper share certificate to electronics so this is absolutely fantastic okay this is absolutely fantastic just monitor your share know the buy and sell price of your stock you can actually do this okay you can know the buy and sell price of your stock you can also know how many how much shares you have it's, it's this is pretty much like for you to be able to monitor your portfolio outside your stock broker i have my stock broker account but also i have account with cscs outside my stock broker so i monitor them from corner you know because you need to be smart okay so i thought to share with you you know the need for as an investor what you need to have fair enough you have your portfolio but you need to have an account by the side okay for you to be able to monitor your shares make sure that it tallies up thank you very much guys for listening if you are new to this channel if you like what i'm about please consider subscribing thank you